Oh God, what did I do? It's okay. okay. All right. Good morning. I'm sorry, guys. I, I was so into it. I forgot about the people on Facebook. But anywho, no, we got okay. on this, this recording. We give God all of the glory. Um, thank you, Tracy. You're welcome. Um, for being a supporter, for being a woman of God, for being a woman of excellence, for being a woman of purpose, and being a woman of vision. Thank you um, for having me today. Amen. Thank God. I am super excited for what God is doing mm -hmm. in the lives of other people. Amen. Right? Um, your purpose starts with other people. Mm -hmm. How you're able to make an impact in the lives of others. What you're doing with your gifts and your talent. Amen. That God has placed in you. So I'm just super excited to be here today to share with Amen. you and your audience and everyone. There, God is real, okay? God is real. And the Bible tells us that our gift will make room for us. Amen. Amen. And okay. oftentimes we don't, we underestimate what the gift what that means we mm -hmm. a lot of people say it but are you really embracing that thing are you really embracing your gifts are you allowing your gifts to make room for you do you know what your spiritual gifts are or do you kind of have them confused you even know. with gifts and your skill sets because that's two totally different things and that's why i love the millionaire mastermind business forms that we have every single month the third Monday of every month to empower the next generation of women leaders. We are ending poverty through entrepreneurship for women Amen. worldwide. This is our time. It is our time. It yes, is our is. time. You we know who said so? It. God said so. Amen. Amen. You know what? I am truly, I truly feel it. Actually, you know, this is so, in, this is so into what God has purposed for us to do. You know what the next song is coming up during our break? It's Kelly Price's It's My Time. It's How about that? Time. You know what? So I want to, we talked about the Millionaire Mastermind. The next one is coming up October 25th. So ladies, it's always on Eventbrite. You can see her on, uh, you can see it on Millionaire, Millionaire Masterminds Academy, 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 Academy on Facebook.com. Millionaire Masterminds Academy.com. Ladies, I want you to make sure you take note. Invest in yourself by going to this event at on Mondays from 2 to 4, 2 hours. Some of you guys bull crap on Facebook for 2 hours and get nothing out of it. You know what I mean? You just get a lot of negativity. But this event you will go to on the third Monday of each month is empowering. It's uplifting. It will take you to another limit that you didn't even thought you could go. It will stretch you to you can go to the maximum to where you want to go. But you know what? What's even more so interesting is you said that some people are on social media for two hours bull crapping around. Mm -hmm. Well, the, the worst part is that some people are on social media for hours, 16 hours, 17 mm -hmm. hours, 20 hours, just consuming nothing but junk. Mm -hmm. And so what you take in, you become an a product of that environment. Oh my God. So you are what you do. You reap what it is that you sow. Mm -hmm. And so it is a free event, but it's a priceless event. Amen. Right? I totally agree. And you know what, Bowman, and when, since I first, I think I've, I've been to about maybe nine or ten of those. And I'll tell you, on Mondays from two to four, on the third Monday, I'm busy. You know what I mean? People, hey, what are you doing at two, one third? I don't like busy. I am productive. I am productive. I'm That's sorry. Right. I am productive. Sorry, I shake my shoulder. Uh, no, I can't. I'm sorry. I'll, call me Tuesday. Tuesday's open if you want to meet. But Monday, 2 to 4, I am sorry. I, I'm i productive. I got it. Now, let's talk about, um, when we talk about business owners, there are so many people that want to become business owners. Why are people afraid when it comes to being a business owner? Why are they so afraid? I think one of the main reasons why people are afraid of entrepreneurship is that they fear the unknown. They fear what they don't know. Or they feel like perhaps they don't know what they need to know to walk into their gifts and to mm -hmm. um, really become an entrepreneur. And one of, one of the amazing things that I like about God is that he uses ordinary people to do extraordinary things. Thanks, God. 
Hallelujah. And so with saying that, this is the exact reason why I created the Millionaire Mastermind Academy to help women to overcome the fear, the doubt, the disbelief, mm -hmm. and or even not knowing what to do and how to organize their thoughts intelligently. So that's one of the reasons. And I believe that so often people listen to what everyone else has to say. Mm -hmm. Yes. You're going to ask Sue that's sitting on the sofa all day about entrepreneurship. Yeah. You need to leave Sue where she is, okay? Mm -hmm. You need to start surrounding yourself with people who are not afraid. And you cannot be afraid to fail. I say fail forward fast. My first three companies failed. Mm -hmm. But I decided that I wasn't going to give up. Amen. And I decided mm -hmm. that I was going to profit from my failures by continuing to go. So don't be afraid to fail. Do not fear the unknown. And God will never give you the end from the beginning. But if you would just go and surround yourself with the right people, with the right organizations, Amen. with the right attitude, yes. being positive. Because nobody wants to be around a pessimistic, negative person. And with energy. With without, bad without energy. energy. That's yes. right. So... If you can get over that piece, you can become an entrepreneur. It doesn't matter where you started. All that matters is how you finish. Amen. And if you're transitioning from corporate into entrepreneurship, mm -hmm. if you are an aspiring entrepreneur, or if you're an entrepreneur right now and you feel that perhaps the things that you've been doing may not have really been fruitful, I think now is the time because it's Amen. proper timing and proper alignment is key. And that's exactly what the Millionaire Mastermind Academy is for. We're not just information, but we are impartation for transformation. Wow. You took the words right off my lips. I'm telling you. I was going to say, but transformation. Now, back to the um, what mistakes do uh, those make who want to be entrepreneurs? What, what are the mistakes that they are making? In the beginning, I know you said about Susie on the couch. They're asking Susie, who's sitting on the couch eating do JoJo's and Juju's and all that stuff, and she, you know, she wants to open up a penny candy store, and that's not that's not what God has gifted you to do. You have to find out what your gift is. You can't do what Susie is doing, or you can't do what Velma's doing, or you can't do what Trey Lou's doing, or you can't do what Rachel is doing. You can't do what somebody else is doing. You have to find out what God wants you to do, right? So what um what mistakes do they make? Well, the first mistake they make is understanding, not understanding their why. Mm -hmm. What on earth am I, what was I put on this earth for? What was I put on this earth to do? Why? Why did God create you? Because we were all created to solve a problem. Amen. All right. Yes. And so that's number one, understanding your why, all right? Because God doesn't make trash, right? Mm -hmm. Everything, the Bible says that everything God created was good. Hey, amen, right? amen. And so that's the first thing. The second thing is most people are now creating businesses based on what they see other people do mm -hmm. and for money. Those are the wrong reasons to start a business. Amen. Right? The reason you want to start a business is to solve a problem. And to build up the community. Solve a problem. When you're solving a problem, you're building up the community. Amen. You're creating jobs. You're breaking generational curses and strongholds. Lord. You're being used to leverage your gifts. Amen. So it, it's all connected. You have the gifts, you have your why, and you have understanding the problem that you're solving. Because poverty is a state of mind. Mm -hmm. you hear that? Poverty, poverty is a state of mind. Is a state of mind. 
You know, Velma, I want to, um, we're going to talk about the Pioneer curriculum in a couple of minutes, but I, I always want to make sure that I just just jump into, it's almost like you're going swimming. You get on the diving board and you just, you're jumping in because you have allowed so many people to brace and open up their new businesses. How does it feel knowing that God has birthed you and he has created you? This is your gift. How does it feel finally knowing that this is your gift? And when you see that woman that has come to the Millionaire Mastermind and has invested in herself, and she finally says, you know what, Velma, I did it. It's happening. And you see it. You know, there's a, a lot of women that have, their faces are on the front of Fortune magazines and magazines all over all over the world. You've seen them from the beginning and you see them now. How does it feel when you see that this woman that you told her, when she first walked into the door of the Millionaire Mastermind, we got this. We're, you will be an entrepreneur as long as you believe and have faith. How does it feel? Let's walk, walk us through. How does it feel? Man, it's it's a very, very gratifying feeling. It's very humbling to know that God have chosen little old me, little old me mm -hmm. Amen. to do such huge assignments. But you know what? He picked the right people because I'm for the people and I'm for God. And I believe that all things are possible. So I don't have any limitations in my mind. Mm -hmm. And that's generally what happens. The, the limitations start in our mind where the enemy plant those seeds of doubt and things like that in our mind. And so... If I can get a million women in the next year to understand yes. that they have what it takes to be successful and that they have what it takes to shift the dimension of these generational curses and strongholds, it is truly a gratifying feeling and I give God all of the glory, and I honor God Amen. with everything that I have. Amen. Amen. You know what? It's just an awesome feeling. Just you know, I don't know if you guys, you can't feel this energy in the room, but you should feel this energy as she is speaking uh, throughout these the fifty people, the seventy thousand people throughout the land, and also the seventy three countries and out there. You know what? This is truly a time for you ladies and men, whomever, to embrace this moment as we have Velma Traham here talking about what it is to be a business owner, an uh, entrepreneur, and also what the steps that you need to take to make it happen. This is the time. I don't know what you're doing right now, but if you're doing something that's not going to be profitable for you and your family or the legacy of your family, you need to put things on pause and stay, you know, just... Uh, you know, go to your phones and go to your, your even turn on the dial in your car or even on Facebook or at you, Tra Tracy Lewis and even on Mas Millionaire Mastermind to see what we are talking about. And also put on your calendars October 21st for the Millionaire Masterminds Academy. Come down on, um, at, at you know, on um, October 21st from 2 to 4. You will truly be blessed. You will, ne you will not come in and leave the same. Open up your mouth. Open up your mind. Embrace the love that's going to be and the energy that's going to be in the room. Let's talk about this Pioneer curriculum because this is what's this is what's shaking bacon right now. Let's talk about it. What is the Pioneer curriculum? The Pioneer curriculum is a program. It's a twelve module program that mm -hmm. is aimed to end poverty through entrepreneurship for women worldwide, for everybody worldwide, okay? Mm -hmm. The curriculum is for everybody, Amen. right? Everybody. And so I have been blessed and fortunate enough to build so many companies from the ground up. Amen. I have worked with Fortune 500 companies. I have worked and still are working with these organizations. And one of the things that I've learned is that Sometimes you can become so here that you forget how you started there. Mm -hmm. Oh, yeah. And so I began to go back to remember what were some of those obstacles and challenges that I had in the very beginning stages of my entrepreneur journey. And I went and I documented that. And that is how I created the Millionaire Mastermind Pioneer Curriculum. Wow. With starting off with your why, 
understanding what your vision and your mission is, creating a business model, understanding what your target audience and your niche is, putting the right revenue structure in place, understanding the legalities of business, mm -hmm. creating the right marketing and branding strategies. All of those things are important and all of those things are needed Amen. in order to run a successful business. So the Pioneer curriculum is that foundation. It's that blueprint mm -hmm. to help entrepreneurs to plan, to start, plan, and launch their successful business. It is created by an entrepreneur Amen. for and these are and things that you can't even you can't shortcut these you can't you, you can't shortcut these things either. No, that's you can't. You can't go out on do. this yeah. ain't something that's out on Google. You go research it, and it, it's no, 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 no. This is practical advice. This is the things that is being missed right now. Okay, mm -hmm. we can't talk about KPIs and getting federal contracts and all of this until you could, first of all, create a sustainable business model. Amen. Amen. And, well, and you that's know what? what it's oh, about. I'm sorry. Go ahead. I'm sorry. No, it's okay. Um, you know, so where can I get one? They are online, millionairemastermindacademy.com. We're vending all over the place. But right now, the best place to get it is millionairemastermind.com. Soon... We will be in HBCUs, we will be in churches, we will be in ecosystems all around the world because Amen. this is the piece that the world is missing and God gave us a solution to that problem. You know what just came to mind? I said maybe a daycare suit, a pioneer, what do they call it? A pioneer tacticular. For toddlers, you know, for toddlers, <laughs> oh, I don't know. For toddlers, you know, even have make make the pages all bubbly so that the, the babies can read them, you know. I don't know. That's just what came to mind. You know, we always have a good time, you know, Vom and I. We know we love to laugh. And, you know, we're going to go to a quick break here. Uh, it's your time to shine. You have the information, and we'll be right back.
can book seating on my online. Yeah, but, but it's on melmatrahan.com. So I got it. Yeah, we'll just have a window. We'll look at our fancy. Yeah, she was saying. Okay. No. She was. Yeah. <laughs> Thank you. It's 80. Oh, yeah. Yeah. So we'll make sure we connect that too online. Yeah, I have to. This is like, it is a book report. I thought there was a link book online. It is. Available. But I need to put it on the list. But they can get to it online. Okay. They can get to it on the list right here. Okay. But I need to put it on. We'll get that done. Yeah. I'm going to shout put it on the list. Put it on the list. Look at her know what to do. All right, Rachel. <laughs> Well, list. ladies and gentlemen, we are back in the house with Velma Trahan. We have some exciting news coming up here in December. Uh, on December 16th, uh, tell us about the event, Velma. Let's um, explode their ears. Not explode their ears, but let's um, enlighten their hearts and just put some love into them on in, in regarding the event that's coming up on December 16th. You know what? It's time that I let the cat out the bag. Wow. Go ahead. <laughs> December the 16th is going to be an amazing day. First of all, anybody that is seeking wisdom and seeking to be successful, seeking to hear the right advice, December the 16th is definitely the day to put on your calendar. We're celebrating our two-year anniversary. Ooh, ooh. Yeah. Two years, right? Yeah. We've been able to mentor 4,600 women through our monthly business forums. That is truly exciting. So on December the 16th, we're celebrating that and we're honoring women that have taken strides. So yeah. guess what? Nominations are open. Nominations are open. Okay. We want to hear your story. We want to hear how the Millionaire Mastermind have changed your life. And you have an opportunity to share your experience in front of thousands of people, hundreds of people on December the 16th. Wow, that's At the Hyatt awesome. Regency downtown. We're excited about this. So it is the Millionaire Mastermind Academy Entrepreneurship Summit and Awards Luncheon. Mm, sounds good. Sounds good. Now, you know, I'm going to be there. I don't know about y'all. I'm going to be there. I'll probably be have some I'll amazing sweet. I'm coming early. I'm saying, I'm talking about people that are successful and they're going to be very transparent and share how they got to where they're. We're going to have really amazing panels, workshops. And you think the, the fireside chats that we have mm -hmm. at the Millionaire oh, Mastermind yeah. event, you think that's something. Oh, this yeah. one on December the 16th? It's going to be on steroids, okay? Whoa, yeah. yeah so Come get ready, now. get ready, and, and, all right, women will be able to pitch their business Wow. This is for an right? opportunity to win $50,000 for seed startup, for startup, Woo. for now. your business. So we're going to have investors there that are going to be ready to fund their businesses, all right? Hey. So now is the time. So this is me and Mastermind. It's going to be our first global pitch summit. But these pitch summits are eventually going to go all over the world. Wow. But we're starting Gotta right ready. here stay woke. in Atlanta, Georgia on December the 16th. You got to stay ready to keep from getting ready. That's right. I'm ready. <laughs> I'm ready. My stuff is packed. Okay. My bag is in the car. C-A-R-A. Ah. And if you want to book out Velma for a speaking engagement, you can always do so at Rachel at MillionaireMastermindAcademy.com or just go to the website. You know, you know, you all like to search and go on a website and find out what people are doing. You need This is one that you need to be finding out what's going on for real. All that other stuff, you can kick it to the side. That's just, no, that's tarnished stuff. Stuff that will tarnish. This right here will not tarnish. This is when you put your energy into your business and you decide that you are not going to be like all the other few that, not, that do not want to... To proceed to do what God has called you to do. This is your time. As Kelly Price just told us, this is your time. I want you guys to get involved, get engaged, invest in yourself, and stop allowing Tom, Pete, Paul, and all those other people telling, telling you that you cannot do it. God did not create you to just sit there and be in just, just standard waters, just be stagnant. He did not create you to be stagnant. 
Stagnant water stinks. Do you want to stink? I don't. I'm out. You know what? I want you to let them know how they can follow you and how they can, you know, support you and what you do. And let's, let's, talk, let's talk about that. And I want you to lift up a young lady right now who is on the fence as to what she wants to do. She doesn't know. She's not feeling herself. She doesn't know. She's been through so much pain, so much pressure, and she's lost her faith in God. I want you to lift her up this morning. I know there's a woman out there that's just has, she's at her wit's end. She's tired of working nine to five. She's tired of people giving her false moves and false motives and just telling her lies about what she should do and also just taking her money. Mm. What should she do? I want you to lift her up this morning. Whoever you are, know that you are fearfully and wonderfully made. You are a daughter of the most high God. Nothing the devil says is true. Mm -hmm. He's a liar and the enemy is here to steal, kill, and destroy. Not talking about stealing out of your purse or anything like that, but stealing your dreams, killing your ambition, robbing you of your destiny, robbing you of the prosperity that God promises. Do not allow that to keep you down. We all fall down. But it's time to get up. It Amen. is time to be an overcomer. Amen. It is time to be a champion. The Bible tells us that we are more than a conqueror. Amen. It is time to do that. So get up. Like, you know, like really do it like this. You know, like get up. Like, you know what I'm saying? Shake yourself just, off. Shake, shake yourself off. off. And everybody that's been telling you this and making you feel a certain way, tell them today, today, right now, today, right now, is the last day that I will allow you to dictate my future. Today, I am going to take 100% accountability mm. for my life. Yes. For my future, yes. for my destiny, yes. for my outcome, yes. for my purpose, mm -hmm. for everything. It starts with you, and you already have what it takes. So if you're down, and if you're out, and if you feel that God have left you, I'm here to tell you, God have not left you. The Bible states that God will never leave you, yes, nor Thank will you, God forsake you. Yes. And so everything... That's happening. All things are working together for the good. For the good. Yes. Not some things, all but all them. things. Yes, all. So get up. Don't worry about what happened tomorrow, yesterday, tomorrow. Don't worry about what happened yesterday. We're living in the present. Yes. yes. 2020 is right around the corner. Don't wait to January of 2020 to start putting your New Year's resolution in place. Mm -hmm. Start today. Today. Today, today, today. Stop the self-pity. Don't wait on people to support you because they're probably not going to support you in the beginning. Because they're not even supporting themselves. They're not even supporting themselves. And you and God is the majority, right? Yes. You and God is the majority. That's all you need right now. And God is going to put the right people in place. God is going to open the right doors. Amen. God is going to give you what you need internally to walk in your gifts and your talents. Amen. So whoever you are, I love you. God loves you. You love you. Everybody loves you. Okay. <laughs> All right, Amen. so Amen. you can find me on social media. I am on Instagram, Velma underscore Traham. That's T-R-A-Y-H-A-M. I am on Facebook, The Velma Traham. I am on LinkedIn, Velma Traham, and Twitter, Velma Traham. And you can always follow Millionaire Mastermind Academy. We're on Facebook. We're on Instagram. And we are coming to somewhere near you. 
not a theater, but we'll be probably next door. You never know. We may, you may see a couple of chairs being put together on the side of the house or something like that. That could be us. But you know what? It's all in, it's all in God's spirit. So I want you guys to embrace, be open and know that there, God has placed this beautiful woman of God here in Atlanta right now and she's open to go to other places throughout the world and there's no place that I'm sure that she won't go God's God led by you know God led always so I want you guys to embrace this moment thank you for joining us on this day and before we leave out we want to thank you we want to speak to the men as well because we know men are out there there's men that are in the same place that women are so let's speak to men real quick before we um exit uh this stage and you go on to do all the things that God has called you to do Thank you for being here, Valma. I love you truly. And I thank you for all that you've done for me and all that you're going to do for me. And I just thank Rachel for being here, your assistant. We thank God for Millionaire Masterminds. We thank God for Thinkzilla Marketing Company. We thank God just for you. We thank God for King Money. We thank God for everything. We can thank God for allowing you to be here with us still doing what the work that he has called you. And we thank God for you guys listening. Also, she is an author. So ladies and gentlemen, if you want to know more about what she's doing in being, as being an author, she has a book saying, when God says go. So, you know, I want you guys to hit the go button on today and, you know, look into what God has for you on today. Let's talk to the men real quick before we leave. Um, men, kings, you guys are kings. My son's name is King Money. All right. Mm -hmm. Gentlemen, all right. This is your time too. Okay. Entrepreneurship is for you too. All right. Invest in your woman. All right. Invest in your woman. Don't just sit back and let her try to figure it out. You are the head of the house. All right. We honor you. We love you all. You are the kings and we, we truly look up to you as women. And we're excited for what God is doing in your lives as well. Because you are the head and not the tail. Amen. Amen. And thank you, Tracy. I really am grateful for this opportunity. Um, Rachel, who is our um, VP of the Millionaire Mastermind um, Academy and um, our sales and marketing director. And all of the other supporters and people that support us as yourself, I really Thank you. We're very, very grateful. Um, anyone who wants to get involved and join our God Squad, we are, you know, we're we're accepting people to come along and help us to end poverty through entrepreneurship and whatever that means. So we don't want people that think they're too pretty. We want people that's not afraid to get out and really do the groundwork because this assignment that God has us on is a huge assignment and it's not for those that are that are a little fragile so can't be weak you just have to you know you have to you know iron sharpens iron if you're iron and you need to be sharp and this is the place to be it's not a pencil sharpener this is correct <laughs> so i want you guys to um you know be blessed and uh, thank god for this friday and uh you know what you know this is just truly an awesome time i want to say hello thank you this is trey lou with positive vibes and uh we're going to go out with uh moretta brown clark one god here we go you crack me You're so funny. If you are iron, you need sharpening. This is the place for you. This is the sharpening.